Hello family, today is Friday, June 15th, 2012, and we are getting ready to make some snickerdoodle cookies. So first let's go over the ingredients and their measurements for this particular dish. Okay, we have two sticks of all, um, unsalted butter. Um, two sticks equates to one cup, so we have one cup of unsalted butter. We have one and a half cups of sugar. We have two large eggs. We got two and three quarter cups of all purpose flour. We have two teaspoons of cream of tartar. We have one teaspoon of baking soda and a quarter teaspoon of salt. Now, once we begin to roll them all up, we're gonna have some cinnamon and some extra sugar to roll them all up with, but we're gonna do that later. So let's get started on the process. We're going to begin by adding our butter. Our eggs. And our sugar together. And we're going to begin blending those guys together. While our moist ingredients are blending, we're going to add our flour, our cream of tartar, our salt, and our baking soda together. And I'm going to just simply blend this. At this point now, you want to preheat your oven to 350 degrees. Now you want to begin to start adding your dry ingredients. A little bit at a time. Okay, family, I have now mixed it all up. So what we're going to do is we're going to place this all on some a plastic wrap and we're gonna place this in the refrigerator for about 10 or 15 minutes. This um, dough here will yield you about three dozen of cookies. Okay, now, sorry, you simply want to cover this up. Like so. And we're gonna put it in the refrigerator and allow it to cure for about a good 20 minutes or so. Now, um, you're gonna roll them and then you're gonna dip them in this um, um, cinnamon and sugar mixture. It's three tablespoons of sugar and three teaspoons of cinnamon. So let's get started. You want to get about a good teaspoon or so. Roll it around like so until it's a nice ball like that. And then this is parchment paper. So um, you should have already set your oven to 350. Place them all on parchment paper and bake them for about eight minutes. Okay, family, this is our final result. 
of our snickerdoodle cookies and one thing about the parchment paper they will not stick okay they won't stick on this at all the cookies will be um, cooked through and through and snickerdoodles are very very moist so you see how they come together there so my hope is that your children enjoy this as much as mine. I love you guys for watching and you guys have a good night. Bye-bye.